kind of come in with choice blades. That was, my brush got a little too fat and that's all right. If I find it getting a little too fat, I remove a little bit of the paint and I try to use the edge a little bit more. But you kind of want a mix because there are sort of like clumps of grass that act like blades and you don't want to get too much, too caught up in like individual blades. It just makes it too detailed and then you kind of lose the feeling, you kind of lose the looseness. So as we get closer, I'm really just putting, um, I'm really just putting the light, I'm using the, saving the lightest values and the most detail for the foreground. Okay, now let's get back to our purple bunny here. <laughs> So our purple bunny is, he kind of looks like an Easter egg right now. <laughs> oh, he's kind of funny. Um, I'm actually, he's brown in real life, but because we pushed him purple, um, I think I'm going to, I wasn't, I was going to try and mix the browns, but they were coming out very, uh, let me see if I can. I'm going to use a little bit of our Van Dyke Brown. I'm going to add some orange to warm it up. I'm going to kind of try this on the bunny and see if I like it a little bit better. You can always add a little bit more orange if you want to make it a little bit warmer. 